Arthas kills his father. First result. Oh, uh, it's only two minutes. Okay, we'll, we'll watch it real quick. So this is what the cinematic, like, goes back to, right? Is whenever uh, Anduin opens the doors. Oops. Right here. There it is, dude. Ah, my son. You no longer need to sacrifice for your people. You no longer need to bear the weight of your crown. I've taken care of everything. There it is, dude, right here. What is this? What are you doing, my son? Succeeding you. This kingdom shall fall, and from the ashes shall arise a new order that will shake the very foundations of the world. Those are the fucking days, man. Those are the motherfucking days. Holy shit, that was badass whenever that first happened. Like, I remember the first time I saw that, I was so fucking hyped, man. Like, I'll, I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, the, yeah, the Kingslayer. Yeah, exactly, there it is. Happy Father's... T oh, is that what it said? Oh, there it is. Yeah, I didn't even notice that. I don't know, like, I think that's the only, like, really good Arthas cinematic, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let me see. I, I think that's pretty much it. Uh... Yeah. Yeah, pretty much. The Wrath one? Oh, well, besides that one, I mean, like, I, I, I'm not gonna- I don't want to watch that one again, because I've seen it so many times. Uh, yeah, I, I really don't want to watch that one again. Frozen Throne ending? Yeah, I guess that one was good, too. Were those the only real two, uh, the two cinematics? Let me click on the Warcraft 3, all the cinematics. So, this was... Yeah, this is whenever Medivh came. Okay, I've seen that before. And this is where... Okay, yeah, that's whenever Arthas did the thing. That's Archimond. This is that guy. Fuck that guy. Grom is dead. Okay, where's this? Oh yeah, this is Illidan. Where he calls the Nog out of the sea. Oh, this, this part right here. Yeah, this is the only other one right here. Uh... Spoilers, yeah. This is when it becomes the Lich King. Odin versus Arthas. That's the worst cinematic that's ever been made, dude. Literally the worst one. So that's like the original Ice Crown Pillar right there.
your men home. I just feel like this part was so good, man. You lost your mind, Arthas. You lied to your men and betrayed the mercenaries who fought for you. What's happening to you, Arthas? Little prince, you find when you're dead. There's Nerzul right there. See, this is where I thought Ice Crown was going to look like. Look. It's going to be like that. Not like what we got in game. That was it, dude. That was it. Doesn't look evil enough? No, of course not. I don't know, man. Like, whenever that, uh... I remember watching that fucking... Like, it, it's crazy, because I watched that, like, over 10 years ago, or 15 years ago at this point. And it's still, like, really, really, really fucking good, man. Uh, Arthas did nothing wrong. No, I, I still feel like Arthas is the, um is probably the best story that they've ever made, right? Like, I, I don't know, like, do you guys agree with that or not? Like, Arthas being just, like, probably the best story. True? Yeah, I would say so. And, uh, I, I, I don't know, like, in a way, I like Garrosh more. In a lot of ways, I like Garrosh more. But I honestly like both of them a lot. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, it doesn't say much. All story in WoW sucks. Well, I don't know about that. I mean, I don't know what you really like in stories, but, um... Uh, I, I certainly, uh, I was probably most hyped. I was probably most hyped for the Lich King, yeah. But I was also very, very hyped about, uh, because, like, at that time, warriors were just, like, getting kited, and that's all the, that they did is just get kited and die. And because of that, I was like, okay, yeah, I don't want to play a warrior anymore. And i just kind of wanted to play something else and that's actually why i was so hyped about wrath is i was actually going to re-roll to a dk i was moments away from re-rolling but uh because i kind of sucked back then my guild wouldn't let me because they didn't trust me to actually be good at it so uh i ended up not playing one but uh yeah they actually stopped me from playing a dk and the main reason why i didn't just do it anyway is because i wasn't able to carry my mounts over if I was able to carry my mounts over, I would have re-rolled to a DK in Wrath of the Lich King. Like, if they had all the same systems, I would have started playing a DK. Are you sad today? No, I'm not sad at all. Why would I be sad? Cataclysm, I was so hyped. Yeah, Cataclysm, I was actually equally hyped about Cataclysm as I was about Wrath. Uh, Burning Crusade, I didn't really care. Uh, Mists of Pandaria, you know. Uh, Wad? I was actually extremely hyped for Wad, too. Because I thought Wad was going to be completely different. But Wrath of the Lich King obviously was like the end of like a 10-year story. 
So I would say Wrath is probably like one step above that. But the WAD cinematic, I do feel like, is probably one of the best ones they've ever made. Uh, I, I, I absolutely do feel that way. Why don't you reroll as a DK now? Well, because I already have everything invested on my warrior. Like, there's there's a 0% chance of me rerolling at this point. But if I was to reroll to another class, it probably would be a DK. Uh, I'll be completely honest. Like, I think about playing a Warlock sometimes, but whenever I play a DK, I feel like I'm playing a warrior that's like 10 levels higher than my DK. Like, that's honestly how I feel whenever I do it. And uh, it's because I just feel like DKs have everything that warriors have and then more, right? Like, playing a DK is like playing a level 120 warrior. That's pretty much what it is. Uh, why not warrior main on alliance DK on horde? I I'm not going to keep two mains on two factions, man. That that's too much work. Like, I'm there's no way I'm going to do that. Warrior main, big agree. Well, yeah, it it's like warriors have everything, or DKs have everything that warriors should have, right? Uh, that's what I'm trying to get at. Warriors can wield every weapon besides wands. Well, I mean, DKs can wield the, uh, you know, the, the power of the fucking undead, man. Like, I would say DKs are cooler overall. Uh, I think DKs are a lot cooler. Uh, DKs are better at dueling. Ah! Uh, I, I think a good DK can usually beat a good warrior. Right now, maybe warriors might have the upper hand, though, because they have so much self-healing. Uh, but generally, I think that's absolutely true. Who would you cast as young Arthas? Uh, Chris Hemsworth. Like, easily. Like, it, it's an obvious choice. Like, that would be the only person that could play Arthas. Yeah. Duh. Um, yeah, I mean, let's be honest. Uh, you'd not work as Arthas? He's an actor, man. He'd work fine. Like, I, I, th I think Chris Hemsworth is actually a very good actor. Like, I, I love Thor. Like, Thor is probably my favorite, uh, uh, my favorite, like, Marvel superhero. Uh, he always has been.